Welcome back. A disease that causes deer to slowly waste away until they die has turned up in Georgia. Ellie Milliken talked to a hunter and a game manager about what to watch out for now that the chronic wasting disease is in our state. CWD was first reported in the 1960s in Colorado, and it's only spread to 36 states. Through the years, just people like, well, you ever get that? Stop hunting. You might as well stop hunting. And then I saw that there it was found in Georgia, and that's when I really did a bunch of research on it. Will Vinson says he's been hunting since he can remember. He now leases a friend's property to hunt on. Poachers are one thing, but if that disease gets here, I'm done hunting. I, I won't hunt out here because one, the meat, I wouldn't eat the meat. Vinson feeds the deer corn and tries to make the property feel like a sanctuary for wildlife. But now worries that could all change. With the case being in Georgia, there's no telling where it's at with how long it takes to develop and it could spread rapidly. Tina Johansson works for the Georgia Department of Natural Resources. She says CWD spreads from proteins called prions that misfold and cause damage to the brain and central nervous system. Last week, the state reported a deer taken just above Valdosta in South Georgia, where it tested positive for the disease. This is the first positive we've ever found in Georgia, is this one case, this one male deer that was harvested right on the Lanier Berrien County line. Johansson says this weekend she reached out to the hunter and landowner and they are helping DNR target deer killing any that possibly had contact with the infected deer. Just a small number. You're not trying to wipe them out or anything like that. But you want to remove the deer that were probably hanging out with your positive deer the most. According to the CDC, there has been no cases of humans with CWD. In Forsyth, Ellie Milliken, 13 WMAZ News. Now, some deer may carry the disease for as long as 18 months before showing signs. If you see a deer showing dramatic weight loss, report it to DNR.